The boys you were looking at, or should I say the children you were looking at, are some of the most sadistic killers in history. This is Robert Thompson and John Venables, and they just might be the most evil children to ever exist. Denise Bulger and her two-year-old son James were at a shopping mall walking around. She let go of his hand, reached in her purse, pulled out the cash to pay for the item, and by the time she looked down again, James was nowhere to be found. She immediately starts looking for him, seconds turn to minutes, and by this time, the entire mall is looking for James. They finally check the security cameras, and they see James holding a little boy's hand. This entire thing took only four minutes. Now now that Robert and John took James outside of the mall, their original plan was to push him into oncoming traffic for fun. Instead, they took him to a canal, continuously dropped him on his head, and beat him. Once they got done dropping him on his head, they then thought it would be a good idea to continuously throw bricks at him, shove batteries in his mouth and in his rear end, and even throw paint into his eyes. Then after this got boring, they thought it would be a good idea to take him to a train track where they then laid James there and watched the train split him into two. The boys were arrested, but as of 2001, they were released completely anonymously.